Hello everyone, welcome back to Creative Rich Stuffs. It's me again. And as you know, after the two videos of the butterfly life cycle, there was a month delay. I'm absolutely sorry for that. Due to unforeseen circumstances, we have to miss making videos. But now we are back. In today's video, we are going to make a very very easy swallowtail butterfly. And after that, we are going to just finish off the alphabet series. So this is the last origami before we just move on to alphabet series. So for this one, I am using a printer paper cut square. So. You can check out how to make that on the DIY origami. There is another video that I made. You can check it out. And if you want to know that how to make a square without any creases, a creaseless square out of a printer paper, then also you can check out on my channel. I mean, and what I mean by creaseless is like this. So this is a creaseless square with absolutely no creases, just made out of a printer paper. So why am I using a white square? Is later I'm going to paint it. Yes, I'm going to paint it later. So now let's get started with the normal folds without wasting any time. Just fold it diagonally in half. So we are making a water bomb base. Easy peasy. Diagonal fold is done. And now unfold and now do a diagonal fold from here to here like this. And now fold this point to this point. And rotate and do the same thing with this area. Just fold it up. Just open this big pocket and just squish it. And now what you are going to do is just fold this up like this. So for we are we are going to fold this edge to this edge like this. And while doing it you just don't make a crease you see this line right over here it runs from here till here just press on the end of that line and unfold and now using this mark on this mark you need to fold up aligning perfectly and then fold Then turn over and you just need to fold it like this. Now you need to fold it like this. Yes. And then now we are going to make a sink fold. So unfold all of this. Just unfold it. And now you see a square in the middle. Just go through the square. Just make all the creases. Like this. And then you just need to push this down 
and put the fizz in and make a fold. Now what we are going to do is just fold this down and fold this down too. Let it go down. Then just unfold this and then fold the, this edge on this screen. And now if that it is like this uh, you can just turn over and so we are going to just fold it like this after some time so let it stay in this fold first we are going to fold both two flaps up so we are going to fold both of these flaps up like this And then do the same thing with the other flap. And then turn over and then fold this up to the top and fold this down like this so that it becomes like this. And do the same thing with this. And now that it is like this, you can already see the shape of the swallow tail. Now we can add more details. So now we are going to fold it like this. If you like it like this, then it is done. But if you want to add more details, yes, you can add it. Now, what we are going to do is, it's the thing. So what makes a swallowtail a swallowtail? Okay, the tails on the wings. But for that tail, we need to make the body because there is no body over here. So what you can, what we have to do is just open these wings. And you see this flap. Just put this flap down. Like this. And then fold this in like this. Then just fold them in. So they are in now. And there you have it, the body. Now we are going for the tail. So what we are going to do is just take this wing and just fold it down like this. And do the same thing over here. Take Take the wing and just fold it down and I have just aligned both of those so now you can clearly see the body of the butterfly now we, what we have to do is we have to make a fold that starts here and ends up here so we are just going to Make a fold like this and do the same over here. Just align it with the other wing. After that you can just open it up and now we are going to add just a little more detail to the tails.
Now you can just hold it like this. And do the same thing over here. It looks just fine with it, but I just want to do a little modification. Just want to make a reverse fold so that I can just tuck that tail in. Right like this. And do the same thing over here. You can do this if you want. This also looks pretty good. And then I am just going to add a little detail. So what I am going to do is just remove this flap. You see this tiny flap that is fold at the sink fold before. You just need to fold everything at its crease. And now, from here to here, I'm going to make a fold. Like this. And the same thing over here. It starts over here. Then it goes on and then here. now the butterfly is actually complete so now what i'm going to do is i'm going to paint the butterfly so let's start the time lapse of the butterfly painting <laughs> Hey friends, did you like my video? If yes, smash that like button and share this video with your friends. Also, subscribe to my channel. That's it for now. Bye-bye.